Hi there, sign of Sagittarius. This is Kim here to do a reading for you. It's going to be for your next uh, 48 hours. And I think what we're going to do is pull um, one card from the Good Tarot and then a Celtic Cross, perhaps, with the Surrealist Tarot, which is art. It's, it's really interesting. <laughs> interesting art. Thanks for liking, sharing, and subscribing. Let's get into this reading. Calling in your spirit guides, your angels, higher self, higher power. Let's get messages um, for their greater good always. Sagittarius. One card, please. Giving us kind of an overall energy for the reading. For Sagittarius. Overall energy for your reading is the Three of Earth. Three of Earth, Three of Pentacle. Um, the Three of Earth is cooperation, guidance, not having to do something by yourself, knowing you're not alone. So there's another message of um, you're not alone. Um, this can be about learning new uh, skills, new abilities, apprenticeship, apprenticeship, <laughs> apprenticeship. Yes, right. <laughs> so, three of earth, learning a new skill, or um, perhaps more self-study, self-taught, self-study. And like I said, cooperation, collaboration, that is the theme. You scratch my back, I'll scratch yours, so something of... Um, this nice balance here, creative force, laying the groundwork. Okay, so this is the Surrealist Tarot. Let's get messages for Sagittarius, please. What is the issue for Sagittarius? The issue is the Devil card or temptation at its best, right? Temptation at its best. Um, the devil energy, you know, it, it can keep us attached to things. Um, so we we never really know how far or big we can grow or ascend if we are attached to these things that the devil energy has us tied down to. So knowing what those things are and confronting them um, is usually the best plan of action. Or just being aware that that energy is here and it might tempt you, right? Materialism, greed, it might be something like that. What's the challenge here? Or addictions, any kind of addictions. Yeah, so there's, there's a, new, um, a new chapter wanting to pop through. Wanting you to experience a new cycle. Uh, an, an elevated cycle. It looks like um, things are being put up. It looks like something is, it's all the puzzle pieces are fitting together. So the challenge is this completion. Um, to give up a detachment that stops you from going forward. Something that maybe self-sabotage here could be in play. The magician in the reverse, it it um it stops you from being able to um, manifest everything that you possibly could manifest. So you sell yourself short uh, when it comes to this devil energy and what you're actually able to create with the magician energy here. Okay, just making sure you can still see. I think you can see all that. So the magician energy in the reverse is um. Wanting your full attention and some of it it can't get because of this uh, shadowy energy that maybe just needs shadow work, right? And look at that. There's this there's the apple in the nine of swords I'm looking at this as temptation again <laughs> But here in the past energy, it's like a, my hands are tied. I don't really know what to do Um, There's a lot of heavy thinking going on. Perhaps we're causing our own storm clouds. Um, 
too much worry. Sleepless nights. Sleepless nights. And what's the now moment? For Sagittarius, the now moment. Ace of Swords in the reverse with the Six of Pentacles here. Looking like a tower energy, but it is uh, successful. It is... It's hitting the mark. Something is not clear to you right now. Can't see up for down. <laughs> so something something is just not very clear. Um, I feel like it has to do with uh, a give and take energy or an exchange energy. Compromise, you scratch my back, I scratch yours. That, that energy's coming back again. What's the future energy looking like for Sagittarius? Future energy. Mm, the Page of Swords. Interesting pipe, right? It almost looks like... It's strange. It's strange. I like it. Um, needing more information need more information and maybe you're trying to figure something out or develop a strategy um more research needs to be made into this three of earth is is indicating more research being made or looked into and so is the page of swords it's the truth coming in so it's whatever you are not clear on at this moment you will be clear on in your future energy okay so how do you feel Whoa. Hurt. Three of Swords. Three of Swords. Perhaps hurt on social media. Gossip. Third party situation. That's a challenge. The heartache. So feeling heartache. Feeling heartbroken. Ready for new inspiration at any moment. Feeling vulnerable, but ready to breathe in this inspiration as if you were the lungs here. New inspiration. Inspiration. Because you're growing. So the root system's exposed. There's some vulnerability here, but you're growing. Okay, in your environment, I have the tower in reverse, which was what um, this that looked like to me with that ace of swords. So there's something that we're recovering from that we're trying to build back up with this tower in reverse. Um, uh, we're having to think about how we want to build, um, and, and starting from the ground up is what this is coming across to me as. Let's see what card represents the hopes or fears here for Sagittarius. The Hierophant. Commitment. It's going to be talking about soul contract or being asked, um, you know, to accept a job commitment or... Um, a marriage proposal or something like that. Um, five indicates that there will be changes. Changes in your commitment, possibly, or what you're committed to. <clears throat> the outcome for Sagittarius, the outcome. Oh, the Ten of Cups, goodness. You got the Ten of Cups and the Temperance in reverse, so it's divine timing is about now for you to get your Ten of Cups. Complete happiness, complete bliss. <laughs> You're getting out of your head every step of the way here. This Ten of Cups is complete happiness. It's long-lasting emotional happiness and fulfillment because Temperance here in reverse says it's about time. It's time to let go of this heartache. It's time to um, not give in to temptation if you can. But, you know, 
life is experience, whatever experience you have, don't judge it. Resist the urge to judge. Okay, so Ten of Cups for outcome. Can't get anything better than that. Sagittarius, what else? It's like love comes first and, and then all the other stuff falls in line. And here we go. With It landed on this Three of Swords, which is the heartache card or third party. It says there's something better. There's something better here. There's something better Let's get a fortune cookie too. I have nature. Interact with nature in the outdoors, around animals, farmlands, or by the ocean. This will be good for the soul and healing for you because it's about divine time. <laughs> All right, sending you love and light. Bye bye.